Mayor Greenberg's proposed $1 billion budget is now in the hands of Metro Council members. You're watching Wave News at 6. I'm John Ball. And I'm Myra Ansari. The new budget focuses on what Greenberg describes as the city's absolute priorities, and it's filled with pay raises for city workers. Wave News reporter David Mattingly is at City Hall right now, live with more. John, if this budget goes through, then emergency medical technicians will see the first of three steps of a raise totaling about 33% over the next three years. Mayor Greenberg used them as an example of city workers who are underpaid and why it's so hard to fill some city positions. So it's the right thing to do and the smart thing to do, to pay them what they're worth, both union and non-union public servants. When the public demands better services, Greenberg says it starts with better paid workers and more competitive salaries. And his new proposed budget doesn't stop with EMTs. Underpaid workers and unfilled vacancies are a problem throughout Metro government. Greenberg wants to hire more early childhood teachers, more library employees. All of this in addition to filling 260 vacancies at LMPD. The $1.1 billion budget proposal that I'm submitting to you today focuses on meeting those needs, making progress on those priorities, and investing in the people who serve our community. Under Greenberg's budget, spending for the next budget year will focus on familiar priorities. There's $448 million for public safety, $32 million for affordable housing, 50 million for street maintenance and improvements and 7.1 million for repairs to city parks. And this is just the first step in the budget process. There will be public hearings along the way and Metro Council will have a final vote sometime in June. Reporting live, David Mattingly, Wave News.